Now, anytime you find yourself in guard, full guard is a good thing. Punch, you know, you want to distance the punching first. So if he's going to punch me, he doesn't go both hands, right? Because then you can pull him in. He always is going to put down a hand to punch. So if I'm focusing, he sits up to punch, one of his hands is going to stay on. So now, this always has to be my focus on. So as he comes down to punch me, I want to get this reverse grip, this reverse more grip. So he goes to punch me. Help steer. He goes to punch me. Boom, I can help steer. He tries to pull his hand back and sit up. I can get this underneath. Once this is underneath here, I can go for a Kimura, or this is going to help me get deeper underneath, right? For an overhook attack. But what I want everyone to focus on is getting that, that two-on-one mindset of coming underneath, out of your own wrist, those two hands focused on one, and learning to steer it, which I use this a lot to steer, because if you're so focused on trying to free your hand, you're not passing it. And, that, and you're not punching me because you have one item that can punch me unless you go to hit button. And even then, I can still steer. So if you sit up and try to take this hand away, I got room to grab legs, right? But now what's cool with this is if I grab this plant around the wrist here, my hand's here. If I see the opportunity, that wrist lock is there, right? Boom. If I see the opportunity where he tries to sit up and that hand goes flat, I can grab the ridge of the hand here and as i steer it first off it's already breaking right this also allows me this motion here to help pass it now sometimes if they sit up high enough you might even be able to break it from here right okay because this this motion <laughs> this motion here when you go to punch me it's really hard to punch because i have it against my body so no matter, no matter how big and strong you are I've got it pinned against my body. So let's just say you are super big and strong. You go to hit me and you're going to be able to This also allows me the motion I need to still clear your hand. Okay? So this reverse Kimura grip here, what do you feel like doing to save it? Like everybody, you're going to grab your own hand because that's what we're taught to do. A lot of us make the mistake and dive right into that triangle fight right here. And then now you're going to start walking your knees in and looking up at the ceiling. Okay, so you have an extra hand. So let's go back. If they grab their hand for balance purposes, 